Find the hostage and proceed. What is going on, guys? Ace here, and today we're here with the map layout for the new map Outback in Rainbow Six Siege. Now, this map is interesting. It's kind of an L-shaped map, so it starts here, and then it kind of goes out to the left back there. So it's kind of interesting to see how it works, but we're going to have a lot of this map to discover. So we're going to go over here from the south side first. We're going to go from the fuel pumps, and we're going to go inside here. And this is the waiting room. So this map is nice. It has a garage, which is really big. There's two floors to it. You have um, this upstairs portion also where you can get on to, and the defenders can also get on to. This is probably mostly going to be controlled by defenders, but you have windows all around so attackers can come in. It's not like sectioning you off, kind of like Bartley University was. We have this upstairs portion, which is the garage lounge, and the office, which is one of the sites for hostage, but it's also a site for bomb. But you have the party room as well, and over here you have a full room. We're actually going to go to the first floor first, because I think we should get that out of the way, and then we can go work our way down from there. So we have the garage. We're going to go all from the right, actually, over here. We're going to go into the waiting room where we just came from. I wanted to go from here, because this, this way we can see all this stuff. The convenience store right here. And uh, you have a freezer room, which doesn't really lead to much unless you want to go through the non-reinforced walls. You have the gear store. You have the compressor room. I'm pretty sure, yeah, this is the compressor room. And then you're back into the garage over here on this side. You can also go here to the motel reception. This is the motel area, as the sign says. And this is kind of your west portion of the map. So you have the motel. You can go up over there. You can go up a set of stairs with from that door. But uh, this is pretty much the west side of the map. If you go over to the other side, you can uh, you can go through the walls, or you can just go through the garage area, which we'll do just so that we know where we are. And you can go over here to the restaurant side, which is basically the east side of the map. So there's also a middle, which is the kitchen, which kind of connects everything. You have the kitchen hallway. Which goes to the reptile hallway. This is this is where we were. We just were the re uh, the motel reception side, but the reptile hallway is kind of like the main hallway in between the two, like the the east and the west sides of the map. So you have this. You have a set of stairs here. You have uh, the set of stairs over the here, and you also have a set of stairs over on the west side, all the way over uh, over here at the end of this hallway. We can go check this out right there. So. We're here in the reptile hallway, kind of towards the west side of the map. We can go here into the bush ranger room, which is nice. This this room, uh, no, not here. This this room has like this little fridge door that you can use as cover. You have the bathroom hallway, the bathroom which has like a hole between the toilet area and the shower area. You have the nature room, which I'm pretty sure these two are sites for bomb. Uh, the nature and the bush ranger room, and then you have the reptile hallway again. And you go over to the east side, which is the restaurant and kitchen area. So now we can go upstairs and explore a little bit of that. So let's actually go from the west side so that we're not just kind of in the middle of everything. So it makes a little more sense. Uh, but yeah, again, there's a, there's a back entrance over here. And this goes to the Bush Ranger room, I think. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, Bush Ranger room. So yeah, we can go upstairs. And this will be the northwest side of the upstairs. You have the back stairs over here. This is the motel hallway, so this kind of goes all around through here. Over there's a there's a piano room, but we'll go into that in a second. But we're again, we're still on the west side of the map. There's not like a central location that you can go to. There's the dorms over here. Again, west side of the map. You have the showers, and you have a laundry room right here. It's nice that they labeled everything because it's a motel, so it's nice. It tells you where the stairs are. It tells you where the shower. It's really nice. It actually really helps in learning the map. You have the laundry and we're back to the back stairs again. Uh, and then over here, we can go over to the games room and you have this piano room over here because there's a piano right over there. There's a way for attackers to get in from here and there's like another section of the map over on that side which we can go to. But here, let's go over here real quick. This is the middle set of stairs that we might have gone through, but we went to the west side, so, so we went over there instead of these stairs. So there's another set of stairs over there by the restaurant side, which is the east side. So let's go over and uh, let's make our way over to that side of the map. But yeah, there's a lot of destructibility over here. We can go through a lot of these things. And uh, let's, let's make our way over to sort of the eastern, eastern side of the map. So we have a mechanical bull. 
the garage and everything is on the south side of the map, which is where we entered from. This is the office, and again, the garage is over here on that side, or, or this side. This that's where we came from, kind of from through through that door right there. And uh, we have some more stuff here. So we have office supplies out, outside of office. It's kind of uh, like a connector room. You have the electrical room, which is I'm guessing also just a, kind of a safe area ish for attackers when they come inside they even though there's like two doors right across from each other you have the mezzanine you have the party room which is one of the objectives and if we go around i'm just trying to like lap around places we already know just so that we get a sense of the map and uh so it, it kind of makes more sense cohesively uh the mezzanine is just this top portion of the restaurant basically uh, and then you have the restaurant stairs and that's honestly pretty much it for the entire map it's a little different uh style you have the restaurant lobby over here which i don't think i went through but uh it's just kind of like an entrance area but it's a little more different style of the map there's no like centralized location that you can kind of relate everything back into but uh it's it's nice that it it's a little different you have the gear store over here on this restaurant side but so the east side and um you have the compressor room which we already went to but yeah this map is not too too bad to learn just because it tells you so much stuff out just outside of the map so like you you can tell that like, that's a freezer room and the colors and everything just looks super super nice and everything just works super well in this map but yeah guys that's gonna be it for today's video hopefully you guys did enjoy and did find this helpful basically you want to break it up into like components you have the restaurant side the kitchen restaurant side and you have all of this above you have like the garage side over on the south side which is over over on that side and then you have the motel side which is the west side so if you break it up into those things it's pretty easy to learn you'll get it really quickly and that's about it guys hopefully you guys did enjoy it don't just do it ace it and i will see you in the next video Bye bye